What's going on YouTube? It's Jay Wilson, JWill07, Instagram, Twitter, Jay Wilson on Facebook. You're looking at the center of the tank. Fish are glowing. Um, I've got some updates. Fish are coming in, um, hopefully soon here from Southeast Cichlids. Um, and then I've got some fish that were coming into some serious color. Let me back out so you can see what's going on. I've got this lighting effect that I really like, but my iceberg is like three quarters, I got two of them in there, but this guy right here, he's like three quarters white. It's nuts. Um, the Phoenix looks monstrous. You just seen him take off over there. Uh, Lethronops is looking amazing. The Bucachromis or DZI yellow. The, the eye biter is definitely a male. I was having some concerns when I got him. Look at this guy in the back. Look at that. Insane. In the membrane. Um, everybody's doing well. Combination of great food, good water quality. This is the longest I've ever kept a red top Lawanda. They always seem to just fizzle out on me. But um, I was looking at my tank yesterday and I was thinking, man, some of these fish I've had since kind of the beginning. And so I'll point them out for you. This guy was actually gray when I got him. The sunshine. He is now like highlighter yellow. It's it's um. I, I, it's unbelievable. This guy right here, I call him Flash because um, he likes to whip around like that. But he was so juiced it wasn't even funny. My wife liked him, so I got him. He went completely gray, and then we get that. And he is a pretty, pretty awesome red uh, in person. Um, got a couple of OBs that have been in here for a while. Where do you, He's Blackfin. Where would he go? All right, he's hiding somewhere. There he is. So one of his uh, his fins is black, which is kind of cool. And then um, I've had blue right here. He's got one eye. Bought him, thought he was a yellow blaze. Turns out, nope, not a yellow blaze. <laughs> um, but everybody's doing well. The aggression's really low. Um, you know, you get some fin nippage every once in a while. But if you're watching the video, you can clearly see from these fins that they do a pretty good job. Um, all these males in here, I don't have hiding spots. A lot of these guys are open water swimmers, but it's pretty, pretty epic how I can keep a tank full of colorful males with a low aggression. Now, sometimes I'll get, you know, some sparring up in the corner, um, but overall, if I keep them fed properly and I keep everything changing up, like look at this guy, he's flexing for the camera. Um, they seem to do well. So just wanted to update everyone on the 220, kind of show them the colors. This video is not enhanced. It's shot with an iPhone 6S and the fish are just that good in person. There's been a few people that have actually got to see my tank in person and you know they can tell you that these fish do look just like this in person. I think some of them look better uh, in person like that iceberg over in the corner. I wish you guys can see how white he is. It is, I mean, you can kind of see it when he turns to, look at that. Look at that. Good grief. So just wanted to update everybody. There's going to be some changes coming to the tank. Of course, it's Jay Wilson's tank. What would it be without changing? Um, I, I'm pretty excited about it. Hopefully you are too. I know that some of these videos can get mundane, but I really wanted to give you an update of the 220. I may be a uh, video list for a week or two. Um, just because of the whole change that I'm going to be doing, but um, maybe I'll do it on the 40 gallon breeder and the grow outs that are happening. So thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you so much for subscribing, unsubscribing. If you know somebody, share, share this video. This way I can, you know, I could just get some of this information out there. And um, actually, you guys and girls may be able to help me. I have an ivory head Meloto. He's up in the corner. And He's the one that lost the eye from the eye biter. And then, I don't know, two weeks later, he blew up like a balloon. Thought it was bloat. No signs that it was bloat. He was perfectly fine swimming around as he is now. And he was eating. So I kind of kept an eye on him, what's going on. I thought maybe it's a fast growing tumor. Now it's down. 75% better. He's right over there. You kind of see his belly a little bit. If somebody can let me know what it was, I have not treated the tank. I have not added any fish. Uh, please hit the comments, let me know, or shoot me an email, and it'd be greatly appreciated. So, again, thank you. I hope you all have enjoy your weekend. Enjoy Monday when it comes. Uh, be positive um, because these fish keep us uh, stress-free. You know what's next.